Welcome back folks to Let's Play I of the Beholder 2 The Legend of Dark Moon. Last time we left off we put together Talon and we got into the last tower, the Crimson Tower. Now, I've left a survey uh, for you if you want to answer it. it. Basically I'm asking if you guys need some time to catch up with the episode. So today I'm gonna release only an Eye of the Beholder episode because I know it's probably the less viewed episode. Interesting series, whatever. What is this? Anyways, let me know what you think, vote in the survey so I can adjust. Now, we are left with this puzzle. This puts me here. What if I go here? And here? So, both of these will put me back here. But if I go this way, it puts me here. So there must be something in here. We know the levers do not do anything aside from activating the teleports. And we know that this one produces spheres. I also noticed there is something on the ground. I must have missed it. A crimson ring. I'm, I'm glad we found it. Let's go back. Because as you can see, we have a place we can put that ring. Come on. There you go. Also, we probably want to kill the guys downstairs just because they have a lot of experience, so... Just go with a cone of cold. Okay, there are two of you, not many. Well, let's go anyway with a cone of cold. That should be a good thing. There you go, look at that. Thank you for throwing a fireball my way. He probably had one of those glass spheres. There's a flail, we already seen from the last episode that that flail is not important. I have a scroll of truth seeing here, nothing too crazy about it. And at this point we probably need to rest. Let's make some progress. Guys, this has been a very painful Let's Play. Not because I do not enjoy the game, but because it's made in a way that if you don't have the best characters possible, you're gonna suffer. I mean, this is much more difficult than Eye of the Beholder 1. Eye of the Beholder 1 is a cakewalk. You can win it in any way you want. But this one, if you want to fight the enemies and not speedrun it, this is difficult because if you don't have people with the proper you know things stats you are gonna be in trouble like I have like a very like a very good character from a Dungeons and Dragons standpoint like 17 strength 17 dexterity and 14 constitution if you roll this like when you're playing a session with your friends it is a nice roll like 17 strength is not bad this is not bad but for these games, you need 18 plus. Because these games are not made so that you can roleplay. Ah, sure, I understand there are people who roleplay, yes. But, realistically speaking, uh, who did that to me? I don't know, someone is beating me up. Okay, so let's go uh, this way. Sorry, we need to go that way. Okay, let's go. We need to put the ring in there. That's what they always say. Put the ring on the finger and you'll be happy. So, Slay living? I don't know. Protection from evil seems enough. And in here, there is this thing that resembles a ring, which I'm gonna assume it's this. The world collapses in upon itself and a void opens before you. Will you step in it? Yeah, sure. There is a major scroll of fear. And what are these things doing? They're moving. Where are you? Stop moving. Okay. So the solution to this puzzle is quite obvious. We need those rings if we want to go through. Uh, if we want to take those rings, there is a piece of parchment that is a sticky paper that we need to put down there. 
so it, it's cursed so it's it allows us to take these things so we can move on there you go yes step through the portal the plaque reads one ring to bind them all yes yes one ring to bind them all I'm sure so what are we fight I thought I saw something one ring to bind them all is this the ring this is the mappage ring okay we can bind them all with this ring this floor is very weird now with that being said one ring to bind them all what does the game mean with that we don't have much else here Ooh. this is a secret wall that I accidentally stumble upon now ooh, something else this is a robe what is this robe uh, improve identify this is a plus two robe yay you go to what eight armor so you have a plus one what is what do you get the plus one You have a plus one from somewhere. Or maybe that's... Wait, 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 wait. This is a plus two. You go to plus ten. So this is a plus one robe. And... It does exactly what? Nothing. We don't care. There is another ring here. Or a coin. Okay. So... Doesn't seem like there is anything else here. Of course, there is a plate mail over here, which we will we will identify this thing. It is a plus three plate mail. Obviously, you will be taking this, so you can go to minus one. Okay, if I decide to put this one on you, you go to minus seven. So the dragon skin armor, although good. It is not exactly what I want because even though I get a bonus to fighting with two weapons I think okay let's make a Doro search of this area because there might be secrets here okay no secrets we already did it on this side right okay so let's keep on moving this way Okay, something happened. Something happened again. I don't know. Things are happening here. I wish I knew. The walls are ever changing. It doesn't. Oh, this opens up. What is this? I don't know. Do we need to use the coins? No. So I guess. I guess it's something. Okay, do we get any clues whatsoever? As to what we need to do here. There are stairs, that's for sure. But I would really like to understand what's going on here. How do we fix that? Okay, so this allows me to go. You happen upon what looks like a shrunken giant. He begins to speak. Dran is a coward. Dran is no man. Dran will kill you. If he can. Listen closely. Listen to this. If Dran sees you coming, before he can finish, the loss of his body turns to stone. Uh, okay. It's a cool story, bro. So we need to find a way past those vines. They don't know why. I think those those walls are timed. Am I correct? I don't really know. Maybe I should trigger them like so. It seems like there is something that allows me to change the shape of this. As you can see now. I have access to this. 
what is this? Do I need to dispel magic on this thing? You know? Do we have a scroll of dispel magic also? I don't think remove course is going to do anything. Do we have a scroll of dispel magic? Lightning bolt. Raise dead. Create food. Detect magic. You know what? We can use this scroll. Sure. What about you? Do you have anything here? Shocking grasp? That's shocking, but I don't need it. Fear and the blur. And nothing else. Okay, so let's try this one. Let's memorize for spells. Uh, Zandalor. Instead, you'd be hasting dispel magic and lightning bolt. Do you have anything else here? Remove course. Disintegrate. I don't know. Okay, I guess. Well, we have to heal up, but aside from that, I think we're done. Okay, so try a dispel magic. It doesn't do anything. So, we may need something else. Like, I don't know. Memorize spells. Let's see. Can you memorize anything else? We have a disintegrate. Maybe we need disintegrate. I mean, I don't think there's anything here that we can use. To destroy this, uh, this thing. But perhaps... Perhaps we just need to not worry about it. If only... Okay, as you can see, we move around and we can move through this level. So what happens? Oh, hello. Taco 16. But you throw fireballs, so who cares? Am I right? Zandalo, do you have a haste? Right, so... How about lightning bolts? And also, how about... Oh, I did not memorize that. Okay, cool. Guess we'll have to check every... Nothing is that disappears. It was... Oh! God damn it. Yeah, that's amazing, guys. Okay. Okay. As usual, this game gives its best. Wait. Why are we here on LP24 right here? We have to do this again? Oh my god. We truly have to do this again. Seriously? Where did you come from? Buddy. Well... Beats me, but we have to go back here. We should have the thing, right? So, with that being said, we should be able to move back here and use this to get through. We know we need to... Okay. The sticky parchment. What is this? A mage scroll of fear. It, was, it wasn't there. I don't know. Okay, we need another one of those. There you go. Yes, I want to enter. So what we do now, there should be a mappage ring. I don't know what mappage means, but it means something. Which also means I have to go in here and grab the stuff. Good stuff. There is a mappage ring. I don't know what it does, but it's there. There's a plate mail and we are set. Well, technically no, but... There you go. Dragon skin, Amber, you can wear the dragon skin. And you can give this one to this guy. And this guy can give this one to this guy. So there you go. Nothing else here. Which means we can go up. So one ring to bind them all. Does this mean we have to put this one over here? Or perhaps, not using that way, 
automatically use when worn. No, we're gonna throw stuff at this thing. But what we need to be doing... Well, it is saving, first and foremost. Okay, there are different shapes can be made going this way. Okay. The last of his body turns to stone. But we cannot do anything about it. We cannot uncurse this guy. Which is a shame, really, because... It seems like the only possible way to go is through here. This seems like the only possible way, and that is that field. But we're going to be saving because we're going to continue in the next episode. So thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.